What's up, my peoples? MGO here, the freaking geek himself, and welcome to another exciting episode of MGO Build Stuff, the series where I teach you how to make a protective bunker using pretzels and baking soda. It can be done. But moving on with the Eagle Moss Ghostbusters Ecto 1 kit, we are beginning issue number nine. Hooray for a new issue! So as always, these magazines cover uh, four separate assemblies. So let's flip through the magazine real quick. Of course, we have our rundown. That's a lot of glare. Our rundown of all the parts and bits that we will be assembling. And of course, your instructions, all that good stuff. Now let's get the real good stuff, the behind the scenes stuff. The Scaleri brothers gave them the chair. I have behind the scenes of the Scaleri Brothers. All the cool behind the scenes photos. Making the suits and everything. Again, it's a lot of glare, sorry about that. Like concept art. It's cool. <laughs> yeah, there you go. That's terrifying right there. They should have just left it like that. <laughs> That's scary. But you see the little animatronic heads there. All the behind the scenes stuff. And we have John Rothman. We know who he is. Here's the library guy. He's the library guy. There he is. And Thom Enriquez. So with his concept art, apparently that was early concept art of the, uh, the terror dog. I'm glad it didn't end up looking like that. And we have that. That's, that's terrifying. Yeah. And some early concept art of uh, Stay Puffed. I'm glad he didn't end up, yeah, that I'm glad he didn't end up looking like that because that looks just weird. But just him like melting. You're melting. Slimer's booty. <laughs> that needed to be worked out apparently. There you go. And some quotes. You want to read some quotes? There's some quotes. Some good, some good quotage. Some good quotage for you. There you go. And what's coming up in the next issue. All right. So there is the magazine. Here we have our parts. So let's get down to it. Because ain't nothing to it but to do it. Yay. Slice this baby open. And get out our pieces and our screws. Oh, lots of screws. So many screws. Is that it? That's it. Get this open. And yay! We can commence. And we shall open up our instrucciones. Ay! The instrucciones! So here we are. We are on stage 27. And we are building the engine bulkhead. Cool! Cool. Alrighty. So what are we doing here? So we are just... Okay, we're grabbing this piece first. Looks like. Yes. Yes. Okay. So see, we're grabbing this piece first. And this gets what? What is this? What am I looking at? What am I looking at? When does this happen in the movie? Oh, I think it's this part. Is it this? Yeah, it's this. Okay. Ghostbusters meets Spaceballs. That's, that's what happened right there. <laughs> when does this happen in the movie? Okay, so is that supposed to... Okay, so that goes in there like that. Okay. And then, what are we getting? What are we getting? Try to get my screws organized here. There we go. We're using some EP screws. EP screw, yeah. Oh, ah. Just need one. Oh, that's not a three. I need one. Just one. Just one. Thank you. Thank you. Boop. Alrighty, so let's just get this baby in, get it started, and then, whisker, 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 there we go, that 
was a good screw right there. That was a good screw. That was a satisfying screw. No, we're not done. We're not done screwing. There we go. Ah. 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 That's the sound you make when you know you're in a conversation you don't want to be in. <laughs> You know you're in a conversation that does not interest you one bit when you're making that noise. Oh! Anyway. So, uh, what are we doing? So now we're bringing in this piece right here. This is plastic. It's all plastic. This is plastic as well. So, uh, doesn't seem like we're getting any die cast parts. I don't know yet. I mean, obviously I've not uh, touched every piece yet, but these two pieces so far are just plastic. So what are we doing here? So this goes... On this side, and this goes right here. Alrighty, alrighty, line up the things. I can't see where the ports are, so it's hard for me to line it up. There we go, yay, yay, I did things. I did things, and I did them mildly well, which is pretty much all I can ever do. <laughs> what are we getting here? Happy screws! Happy UP, we OP. Beep, 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 beep. Alrighty. That just gets one RP screw. Alright. This is going by pretty easily. So how are you guys doing? It's my time of the week to check up on you guys. How you doing? How you feeling? Hope everyone is doing well. Hope everybody is staying safe. Here we go. Me, I'm doing good. In case anybody's wondering, I am doing good. I'm just in here building me an Ecto One. Building me an Ecto One. That's what I'm doing. And I'm feeling good. Feeling good about it. Feeling good in the neighborhood. All right, what are we doing now? What are we doing now? What is this? What is this? I'm confused. It feels like we're doing multiple things at the same time here. What am I doing here? Okay, oh, okay, okay. So that's A, B, okay. I'm just looking at things in the wrong order. I was looking at this first and then this, and I was like, that doesn't make sense. Okay, figure A, B, C, D. That's the way that goes. Okay, I got it, I got it. Okay, that wasn't making sense for a second, but I got it, I got it, I got it. Hooray. Okay, so we're using this. That's plastic. We're using this, this is another plastic piece, so we're doing that first. Okay. Order of operations. The most important thing, order of operations. It's funny because some of the things I have messed up on this have just been because I haven't paid attention to the order of operations and did things in the wrong order and messed myself up. So I try not to do that. I try to make sure I am paying the utmost attention <laughs> to the instructions, although sometimes I have my moments where I still kind of skim over something without realizing it. But hey, it's all right. We're all human. We all make mistakes. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. So there we go. Oh, there we go. Nice and snug. Nice and snug like. And now we are using this piece right here, it looks like. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Okay, and that does have a specific orientation with that post. Okay. And we are using a, where is it? A P screw. A P screw, yeah. A -A -P. All right, just need one. Actually, we need two, so let me just take out a second one now because we need an EP screw to secure it in place. So we'll just take out what we need right now. And that goes there. Hold that. You come here. There we go. Oh, look at that. Did you see that? Did you see that screw manipulation right there? You see that screw manipulation right there? You know what that was? Skill! All oh, the skill. Because I have it. That's right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So we have that. Okay, cool. So now, this is going on this side, and this is going where? It's going... Like that. Oh, okay, I see where it's going. Okay, I was, I was thinking it's going to this port. It's going right here. Okay. 
I was just, I confused myself there. That was all. That was me confusing myself. There we go. So that goes right there. And this gets the other Eepy screw. Where'd you go? Right here. Eepy. Okay, I don't think I can do the master screw manipulation here. I just had it. Nope. Come on. Nope. That's not working. Nope. Come on. You can do it. You can. You. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There we go. Okay. Sometimes you got to make that noise to make things work for you. You just got to give it a good, you know, it's just, it's just the way of it. I don't make the rules. I don't make the rules. I don't make the rules. I just, I just make them. Anyway. So what are we doing next? So that was the power. So what was this? Let's, let's go through the parts here. So this was the 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 blower units okay and what we just did now was the power brake reservoir cool and now we're going to be doing the uh the windshield washer okay so what is that that is looks like this piece and this piece come here piece that right yes okay so that goes together. Okay, this has no specific orientation. That can just go on however. And that gets another empty screw. Thank you. You beep when I beep. There you not beep when I beep. How are we supposed to work together? If you don't beep when I beep. All right, this is when I need my grip strength. Come on, grip strength. Come on, grip strength. Hold on, grip strength. Ah, grip strength. Okay, there we go. <laughs> All right, so we got that on. And where does this go? So this goes on this piece also. This goes right here. Like so. That's its final resting place. And this gets another EP screw. We're doing a lot of EP screwing. We're doing a lot of EP screwing here. All right. I see your game. I see your little game, EP screw. Have you been feeling neglected? Have you been feeling unappreciated? Uh, I see. This is the EP screws trying to make a comeback and saying, look, I am the dominant screw here. Not to you, not the IPs, not the HPs, not the APs or the BPs. EP! EP is where it's at. Of course, I would argue that M screws are the best screws, but you know what? I will give the EP screws their due credits. I will give credit where it's due. The EP screws are just as valuable. Maybe not just as valuable, you know, just like a, like a, like a notch under the M screws. So, you know, hey. Hey, we all have our place. We all have our place. All screws have their place for screwing. Okay, so we've done that part. And now we're moving on to this. And oh dear. Oh, we're, we got to bring in the big boy. It's that time. It's that time of the year to bring in the big boy. Okay. Okay, so I got to move things out of the way. Set this over here. And we'll bring in... The big boy. Uh, let me see. How am I positioning this? So I can do this now without driving myself crazy. Okay. Okay. So we're going over here. And this will probably be a case of you not being able to see what I'm doing, but that's all right. So we have to go vertical here and I have to stand up. Okay. It's going to be one of those standy uppy moments. That's fine. That's fine. I can live with the standy uppy moments. Okay, so we are uh, we are here. So we are here, and we have to do uh, some hoses. We gotta do hoses. So what are we doing? Okay, okay, I see what's happening. Okay, I see what's happening. It took me a second there. Okay. It took me a second to process, but I get what's happening. All right. So basically what we need to do is we need to... So we need to put this 
section on first. So it's going on like that, I'm assuming that's going through this hole and that's going to end up here. Okay. Okay. There we go. Okay, so that's going there. Gotcha. Gotcha. Alright, so then as far as the hoses go, this one goes actually I need to I need to put that hose on first before I do this because that's in a place where it is going to be totally hidden. So let me where where my where my tweezer? My 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 hose stretching tweezers. Here we go. We only gotta do a little bit of hose stretching. That's alright, yeah, because I have to uh I need to get that hose right up right up on here. And once you put this piece on, it's basically covering this up. So yeah, I need to put that on first. So all right. We got it. We got it. We got it. Got a little kerfuffled there for a second, but we got it. We're back on track. It's all good. It's all good in the neighborhood. All right. So that should be good. Should be properly stretched it. And that will just go right on here. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Helps if you wiggle them on. Wiggle, wiggle. There we go. There we go. Yep, I think that's on. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. So now we have that on. Now we can put the back piece on. So now we can do this. Order of operations, people's order of operations. Sometimes you get it, sometimes you don't, but. All right, so it just slides right down, sits right there. Cool, cool. All right, so we got that. That's all good. So now we have this hose right here, which will now find its resting place, its final resting place, right back here. Okay, so it's a little post right back here. That's where that's going. So we gotta do a little hose stretching. Actually it doesn't look like it needs to be stretched, but I'll stretch it anyway. But that, I'll also have to kind of back this up a little bit so I can get that on. So you know what, let me just do this again. <laughs> it's not ready to go home yet. It's not ready to go home. Hence why the last step is to then secure all this into place because you have to do a lot of little, uh, little connections and whatnot first, so, yeah, 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 yeah. Alrighty. Well, that should be stretched. That should be stretched good and stretched like. Alright, so now we're just going to try to work this in. Yep, yep, I said yep, I said yep. When I say get, you get. There you go. See where that's going. All right, so now that is where it's supposed to be. Okay, so now that we've done that, now we can just sit this. I believe where it's supposed to go. Where's that hose? Okay, so I make sure it doesn't vanish on me. It doesn't do a ninja vanish. Hose vanish. Okay, so we've done that, and now that we've done that. Now this hose is going to find its final resting place in that piece we just built. So again, let's get a little hose stretching. Ah, so how you guys doing? Me? I'm just stretching a hose. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> you do a little, do a little hose stretching, as one tends to do on a Wednesday evening. That's what I do. Just a little hose stretching. How about you? You do any hose stretching today? Don't answer that question. Don't answer. No, just don't. Don't answer that question. I actually don't want to know the answer. I really don't. Just, just, just keep that to yourself. Keep, keep, keep all of that to yourself. All right. <clears throat> okay. So I think that has been adequately stretched. So now this is going to go right in here. In, on this painted part, which is going to make the post even thicker because it's painted. I'm sure, and I'm right. Come on. I 
these posts aren't a little too thick as it is, and then you paint them and they get even thicker. See, I'm gonna have to do another. I do another little bit of hose stretching here. Hold up. Apparently I didn't I didn't stretch the hose well enough. Needs a little bit of extra hose stretching. So how you guys doing? Me, I'm restretching a hose. Have you restretched any hoses today? Don't answer that question. Don't, just don't, just don't, just don't. I don't want to know. I really don't want to know. <laughs> just... Keep all that information to yourself. Do me that favor. As a personal favor to me, just, just keep that information to yourself. All right. That's a little TMI right there. Just a little, just a little TMI. And there I go in that weird southern accent again. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know why I am the way that I am. All I know is I am what I am, and that's all I can be. Get on there. Get on there. Wow, this hose is really wanting to fight me. Come on, there we go. Nope. Oh my God. This is gonna be, you know what? I'm just gonna do this really quick off camera before I start saying bad words on camera. I'll be right back. All right, we got the hose on there. Only the bare minimum of F-bombs were dropped. So it was actually pretty good, pretty good. That's a record for me, but anyway. Okay, so we got that hose in its place. So now we can start securing all of this in place. So what are we starting with? We are starting with the back section here, the bacular region. And that is getting, what are these? We're getting some OM screws. OMG, OM screws, OOM. Oh, 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 MG. There's some screws. I think this is the first time I've seen OM screws. I think this is a new screw. We're bringing a new screw into our life, ladies and gentlemen. A brand new screw. Oh. It's the first time screwing with this screw. That's beautiful. That's a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful thing. It's a beautifully awkward thing, screwing a new screw. But it's exciting. It's exciting. Exciting nonetheless. The screw a new screw. Alrighty. So that's going on there. There we go. And now we are doing the sides here. So those are getting go down a little bit here. I can actually sit down for this. Let me sit down. Oh, okay. Okay. I can get comfortable. I can get comfortable for this part. There we go. Alrighty. So now we are using IP screws. I, 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 beep, 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 beep. Listen, bag, I didn't tell you to close again. Who told you you can close again? Who told you? Who told you these things? I can't believe you've done this. How dare you? Anyway. Okay, so we're gonna need, what, four in total? So one, two, three, and four. All right. Okay, come here, come here. So now we are securing all of this into its final resting place. And now this is the point in the video where I go into some kind of weird, like, British accent. I don't know. I have no idea. This is in any way accurate in any way, shape, or form. And as always, I apologize for anyone I may be offending with any accents I may be doing. Know that you have my deepest, most sincerest apologies, and at the same time, I genuinely don't care. But <laughs> okay, so we're doing that side. Uh, now we have to secure the other side here. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. There we go. We're going lefty. You ever screw with your left hand? It's like a totally different person. <laughs> oh, God. Anyway. <laughs> oh. 
hey, quality content like this is why you're subscribed to this channel, isn't it? Okay, this is why you're here. This is why you're here. This is what you signed up for. So you have no one to blame but yourself. Just saying. Anyway. Uh, okay, so we've done that. And now we have to do a little bit of pre-assembly before we put it on the big boy. So uh, what are we doing now? So now we are bringing in, what are we doing here? This is the bulkhead struts. We're gonna do some strutting. So we need that and we need that. Are these both the same? These are both the same, so it doesn't matter which one we use. And this is going how, like this. So this actually, this actually does have a thread, so this gets threaded in. This is interesting, okay. All right, I got that on. That was a pain in the butt and I have to do it twice. Oh my Lord, I gotta do this twice. I gotta do this twice. You know what, I'm gonna do this one off camera too. I, I will be right back. All right, got that one. That one, this one was a lot easier. This one for some reason was a pain in the butt, but this one went in easy. Okay, so we've done that and that was the last of our parts, so. We'll just chuck that off to the side, and now we have to bring the big boy back in to the full front, and we need to go vertical again. Alrighty. So what are we doing? What are we doing here? So we are taking these, where are all these? So these are just going to go right here on either side, like that. And like that, I believe. Seems like. These supposed to, oh, it's just supposed to actually go through. Oh, okay, okay. These are, okay. They should go through these holes. Okay, I was like, what the heck? Like, do they just sit on there like that? No. They do have a place. They do have a place. Where is it? I can't see. Oh, there it is. Okay, so that goes there. That goes there. Okay, there we go. Okay. There are actually little holes for that to go in through. I, would just, I just had them like sitting on top of this. But they have little holes they go in through. All right, cool. All right, we got that. And then we use two HP screws. Oh my God, HP. HP, okay. So this was definitely a pretty eventful stage here in the build. This a little bit of confusion. A little bit of frustration, but you know what? It's okay, because we got through it. We got through it in one piece. And this is now in more of one piece. So, you know what? At the end of the day, I'm still happy. So I just get secured right there. Like that. And there we go, and it's all good. So we got that going on. Yay! And that was the Last part, right there. Cool, cool. I can sit back down, yay. Back to ground level, woo. Alrighty, let's move the big boy. Move the big boy back here. And again, as always now, I like to double check my work, make sure I did everything I was supposed to do. What did I do here? What did I do? I did that, I did that. That, yes, that. That, that, and that, okay. Did that, that went there, okay, cool. We got that hose in, we got that hose in. That hose was a pain in the butt, but I got it in. Got that on, screwed, screwed. That was a pain in the butt. Well, at least one of them was, but got that in. Screwed, screwed, there we go. This is what the assembled piece should look like, and hooray, that is what it looks like. So, there you go, we are done with this week's, ah, this week's <laughs> portion of the build. And as always, I hope you enjoyed this episode of MGO Build Stuff. And again, if you would like to sign up for your own Ecto-1 kit, there'll be a link in the description down below so you can check that out. And if you missed any episode of this build, playlist in the description down below for you to check out at your leisure so yeah we're done here so we'll see you next week on another exciting episode of mgo build stuff and remember you don't stop playing because you grow old you grow old because you stop playing big geek be proud 
home in your face.